President Bola Tinubu has announced a disaster relief fund in Maiduguri, Borno State to residents and other citizens impacted by floods and other disasters. The president made the announcement when he visited the state to sympathize with the government and people over the recent flooding from the Alu Dam, which has displaced thousands of residents, destroyed farmland and infrastructure. He says the relief fund is already expedient as the climate becomes more unpredictable and many places in the country are vulnerable to its effect. TV36's Joy Chejim has more on the story. Touching down in Borno, President Tinubu, in company of other government officials, were received by the state's governor, Babaga Nazulu. After a drive through of the areas affected by the disaster, the president visited the internally displaced persons IDP's camp where he assured the flood victims of maximum support by the federal government. While commiserating with the Shewu of Bornu, President Tinubu pledged his government's continued support for victims of natural disasters. In his comments, the Shewu of Bornu urged the president to investigate the cause of the Alao Dam collapse and overflow into the town to prevent occurrence. As a government, as Nigerian people, who we'll pledge with you that we will help in the rehabilitation and resolution of uh, problems there. Yeah. It is our problem, not just your problem, not the problem of community alone. To find out the root cause of this bleeding and address appropriately so as to avoid future occurrence. As over 80% of this town has been affected by this disaster. At the Borneo State Government House in Maiduguri, Tinubu announced the creation of a disaster relief fund while inviting the private sector to collaborate to rebuild affected communities. He lauded the state government Zulum for prompt intervention as well as the theater command of the Nigerian military for the evacuation that saved many lives. For us, let me assure you that we are going to be with you and with Borneo State and make sure that we share the body together when I'm going to leave you alone. And I think with the presence of the excellencies here, if we all tick off a little of a small percentage of our you know takings from Federation account <laughs> on our fact and uh, put it as a disaster relief fund and start to disburse with a committee from there uh, involving all of you. I think we can reactivate and strengthen the sense of belonging in each other's problem. On his part, Senate President Gosfil Akpabiu said the National Assembly will collaborate with the executive to establish the fund. In response, Governor Zulum expressed gratitude to the president, his counterparts, as well as various agencies and individuals for their support to the state so far. I want to thank the Nigerian military who have done exceedingly well in order to rescue our people. The paramilitary have also done very well. And again, I want to commend the Minister for Agriculture. I want to commend the GMD, NNPC, and also NEMA for their continued support. The Vice President was already on ground on your behalf. You also call on NEMA and the other disaster agencies to immediately move in to assist. As Commander-in-Chief, you directed the armed forces to assist in rescuing most of the affected people who were almost drowning in various parts, attested to by the governor of Borno State. So I thank you for your effective leadership. 
The presidency further extended his sympathy to the people of neighboring Yobe and all the states affected by flooding and pledged his government's continued support for victims of natural disasters.